SketchUp University. SketchUp in about 60 seconds or less. The Line Tool. The Line Tool is one of your six modeling tools in SketchUp. The Line Tool makes edges and edges make shapes and without shapes you don't have SketchUp. So to start the Line Tool you can either press the L on the keyboard which is the keyboard shortcut for the Line Tool or you can go up here to the top where it says draw and select line or you can just select on this little pencil over here on the left hand side of it, and that will also give you the Line Tool. SketchUp is very good about making their icons very um, user friendly. So you'll notice in the bottom left hand part of the screen it says start or select start point. I'll select my start point. I'll start drawing a line. You'll immediately notice that I'm drawing it on the axis which is on the green axis. It always snaps to the axis. You don't have to draw on the axis but it's always good practice to draw on the axis. I can go over here and it'll be it'll be a black line because I'm drawing on, I am not drawing on the axis. While this is not wrong it's always preferable to draw on your axis. Right here is the red axis. You know it kind of snaps to the red axis and the blue axis snaps to the blue axis. But anyway, getting back to the line tool, if I'm drawing a line, I'll draw it along the green axis. And you'll notice in the bottom right hand part of the screen, it's telling me how long I'm drawing it. If I want to draw it six feet, all I have to do is type six feet into the uh, dialog box at the bottom. Six feet, return, and make sure you put six feet. You can also put six meters. If you want to draw six inches, you just type the number six and it will default to inches. You know, so now I'm drawing on the red axis and I'm also going six feet. It also snaps to the six feet because that was the last dimension I put in. So you know it kind of snaps there. So I'll go six feet. I'll put along I'll pull it along the green axis and it also kind of snaps once I get to six feet again. I'll snap to the six feet and I'll snap to the end point there. Once I've done that I've created a surface. So the line tools, that's how you make shapes in SketchUp. You always have to go from an edge, a midpoint, or a corner to make an additional shape. If I'm going from the edge there, SketchUp's really good about giving you hints all along the way. Click the edge there, and I will click the edge there, and essentially I have made another shape. So I use the push-pull tool, a keyboard shortcut for the push-pull key. Push-pull tool is the P. I'll push-pull it up, so now I have an additional shape. That's the line tool. For more information and opportunities with Project iStar, please visit the website www.istar.utah.edu